we're going to go over PowerPoint Chapter 4, Guided Project. And we start with this classic photo album. The project description says, The Science Club at your school wants to raise awareness of the fragility of the world's oceans. You volunteer to create a slideshow that can be used at promotional events put on by the club. You use a modified version of Microsoft's classic photo album template. The album has been modified to use blue color to theme. In this activity, you will create the content, insert the photos, modify the photos, and insert a video clip of the ocean floor. So instruction one always is download and open. Instruction two says on slide one, delete the existing picture and insert the downloaded. So slide one, delete. And then I'm going to click Browse, and I'm going to go to Downloads, because that's where it always is. And I want Ocean 1. And then I want to change this text to say Our Fragile Oceans. Instruction number 3 says on slide 2, replace the existing image. Delete. With Ocean 2. <clears throat> and then we want the text to say, Whales are amazing creatures. And include the period. We want to delete slide four. with the picture placeholders. And then on the slide that is now slide four, we want to change the layout to two up mixed with caption. So slide two, layout, two up mixed with caption. We want to delete existing content in the caption and replace with fish live in coral reefs. reefs. Beefs. Okay, now we want to put Ocean 4 in the left picture placeholder. Ocean. One, two, three, ocean four in the left, and ocean five in the right. Delete ocean five. And now insert a new slide five. Click right here, new slide. And it wants it to be portrait with a caption. And the picture that it wants us to put in is Ocean 6. And then the caption is a close-up of brightly colored coral. Include the period. Look at that little seahorse that is so camouflaged. It looks just like the coral. It's amazing. And then we want to delete slide six and seven. Delete, delete. Now on slide one, we want to I'm sorry, I need to scroll up and highlight so that I know which instruction I'm on. We're going to select the picture and remove the background. So I want to go to the Picture Tools Format tab and click Remove Background. And it does it for us. And then it wants us to change color corrections. So I'm going to right click, go to Format Picture. I'm going to go here, Picture Corrections. And I'm going to change brightness to 0%, which it is on 0%, but we want contrast at minus 20. Okay. 
All right, now we're on instruction nine. On slide four, we want to make sure that the text is set to 18, which it is. And then we want to change the font to uppercase. So one, two, three clicks. And I'm going to go up here to change case, uppercase. And it wants us to apply the same effects to slides two, three, and five. So slide two. Uppercase, 18, 3. Okay, so I skipped an instruction, and it said to insert a new slide 3 with the panorama layout. And then we were to put... The picture, which the clue should have been that I skipped a picture. And it wants Ocean 3. And the caption is supposed to be, Colorful Fish Swim Together. Period. And then we need to delete slide four and now we are ready to go back to instruction nine which says that we want the font set to 18 and uppercase on two three and five so two is already done Three, uppercase, and five, uppercase, and then it wants us to right align the text on slides two and five. So I'm on slide five, I'm going to choose right align, and slide two, I'm going to choose write a line. That is a paragraph format, so I do not have to select the entire paragraph. It's going to do exactly what I told it to do. Now on slide two, we want to select the picture and increase sharpness to 25%. Slide two, select the picture, um, sharpness to 25%. And saturation to 200%. And the color tone to 4,700. And compress all images using default resolution and this is compressed picture right click okay um, apply only to this picture no we want it to apply to all of them and then delete cropped areas using default resolution so use document resolution okay that's done. That's going to make your file a lot smaller. Now we want a new blank slide after slide five. New slide, blank. And we want to insert the downloaded video file. And what I want to do is I want to go to list. I want to sort by date modify. I mean details is what I want because I want to sort by date modify. There we go. Ocean vid right there.
All right. That layout is supposed to be blank. There we go. Insert video. Video on my PC. I want to video these, but we want ocean vid. All right. Now we want to trim the video to 3.5 seconds. So playback. Trim video. And we want the end time to be three. Okay. Delete the last slide, which apparently was already done, that displays the waterfall. Set the video to start automatically. So go back here, playback, start automatically, and to um, hide while not playing, hide while not playing. Check spelling, save the presentation, close the presentation, and submit, and you are finished. I just didn't play it. Sorry. All right. Y'all have a great day.